Let me walk you through some of the key features. To start, open our free app, available on both the Android and Apple App Stores. This demo is for a caravan setup, so you'll see the RV Watch screen layout. With the free version, you can track the last location, battery voltage, and total distance traveled. On the main screen, you'll see these details, battery voltage, distance, and the last known location. If you want to change the device name, click on the gear icon in the top left corner. Other settings are not available in the free version. At the bottom, you'll find the main navigation buttons, home, logs, and account. You are currently on the home page. The logs feature is unavailable in the free version. In the account tab, there's a green upgrade button next to the device name, allowing you to unlock additional features. You'll also find the user manual, options to add new devices, and the ability to update your account details here. With the free version, you can monitor the device's last known location, battery voltage, and total distance traveled, all without monthly fees or SIM card charges. It's perfect for basic tracking and servicing. Now, let's explore some features of the paid, full-feature version of our app. Click on the name in the top middle of the screen to switch to another device. This time, the device is a boat, and you'll notice the screen layout provides boat-specific information. This version will send you push and email notifications when something unexpected happens, such as arming, disarming via the remote controller, low battery, power disconnection, motion detection, door switch activation, shore power changes, bilge pump running, high roll, or high water detection. Our system ensures you receive notifications even when the phone app is in sleep mode or hasn't been opened for a while. In the notification settings, you can select when you want to be notified depending on whether the system is armed or disarmed. Just click the box to choose the required state. On the left, there's a gray shield icon indicating that the device is disarmed. When armed, the shield turns green. You can arm or disarm the system by clicking the shield icon or using the supplied remote controller. If the remote is used, you'll receive a notification to stay informed. Next, you'll see the battery voltage and an icon representing it. The color of the icon changes depending on the battery level. Then there's the siren button, which shows whether it's in auto or manual mode. In manual mode, the siren sounds for 20 seconds when you press the button. In auto mode, any motion sensor or door switch can trigger the siren for about 25 seconds. In the second row, the first icon is for shore power monitoring or accessory control, which you can configure in the settings. If set to shore power monitoring, the icon shows the connection status and sends a notification when it changes. If used for lights, a fridge, or blower, you can control these manually via the remote or the app icon. You can also set the accessory control to auto, turning it on or off based on battery voltage. Next to that is the bilge pump icon, which indicates whether it has run in the last 24 hours or shows when it was last active. The rolling pitching icon displays the current state of the boat's movement. In the next row, the odometer shows the current speed and total distance. On the far right is the high water sensor reading. A green tick means no water is detected, while a red cross indicates water has reached the sensor. Finally, the map shows the current or last known location of the boat. This full feature version offers advanced monitoring and control options, tailored for both RVs and boats. If you want peace of mind about your boat or caravan, please visit our website to place an order, w.boatalarm.co.nz or rvishwatch.co.nz.